Good day everyone and welcome again to our another engineering solving session. So problem number one and second law of thermodynamics, the heat rejection by a refrigerator. So the food compartment of our refrigerator is shown in the figure and it is maintained at the four de uh, five degrees Celsius by removing heat from it at a rate of 480 kilojoule per, mi per minute if the required power input to the refrigerator is 2 kilowatts determined a the coefficient of performance of the refrigerator and the rate of heat rejection into the room that houses the refrigerator so the power consumption of a refrigerator is given so the COP and the rate of the heat rejection are to be determined. The steady operating conditions exist. So the coefficients of perform performance of the refrigerator is COP or is equal to QL over the W net input is equal to 480 kilojoule per minute over 2 kilowatts multiplied by 1 kilo kilowatt over the 60 kilojoule per minute so we have four so that is four kilojoule of heat is removed removed from the refrigerated space for each kilojoule of work supplied so b the rate at which heat is rejected to the room that houses of refrigerator is determined from the conservation of heat relation for cyclic devices so QH is equal to QL plus W net input is equal to 480 kilojoule per minute plus 2 kilowatts multiplied by 60 kilojoule per minute over 1 kilowatts. So we have the 600 kilojoule per minute. So the both the energy removed from the refrigerated space as heat and the energy supplied to this refrigerator as electrical work eventually show up in the room air and become part of the internal energy of the air this dem this demonstrates that energy can change from one form to another can move from one place to another but but is never discharged during a process that's all thank you